And coming up, the unmasking of bottled waters. Consumers react to word that many of their pricey favorites come straight from the tap. The U.S. have access to some of the cleanest tap water in the world. Nevertheless, many people have come to depend on bottled water. So much so, it's become a multi-billion dollar industry. Sure, it's convenient, but many also believe they're paying for water from naturally pure sources. As Rob Marciano reports, that's often not the case. Don't let that scenic logo fool you. This water is not bottled from a mountain stream. Now PepsiCo plans to spell it out for consumers, adding the words public water source to the label of its Aquafina brand. And in case you didn't know, Aquafina is actually just purified tap water. That would make me never want to buy Aquafina again, knowing that it was bottled public water. Yeah, like no, just that's tap water just in a cool. bottle. That's, what am I paying for? Wow. How does that make you feel? Like I've been bamboozled and hoodwinked all this time. In a statement on Friday, PepsiCo said, quote, if this helps clarify the fact that water originates from public sources, then it's a reasonable thing to do. Coca-Cola's Dasani does the same thing, purifies and bottles public drinking water. One environmental group found at least 25% of bottled water is actually just tap water. Sometimes purified, sometimes not. We are now exposing an underbelly truth that is a big percentage of bottled water in this country is tap water. San Francisco's mayor banned city workers from buying bottled water, citing environmental concerns and saving the city half a million dollars a year. And let's face it, it's expensive. Brands like Fiji can cost eight bucks a bottle or more at high-end hotels. Ironic that droughts have led to water shortages on the island that exports it. In total, Americans snapped up $11 billion worth of bottled water last year in a country that has some of the cleanest public water in the world. Spring water, artesian well water, purified tap water. Not too long ago, it would have seemed a little wacky to sell bottled water, but now it's become part of our culture. And sales of these bottles rank second only to carbonated soft drinks. So in this saturated market, it's increasingly important for you to know exactly what you're paying for. Rob Marciano, CNN, Douglasville, Georgia.